I still entertain the hope that I can prevail upon you to join me. I appreciate, of course, that the beauties of nature mean little to you, but I believe you would have found some of the guests at my hotel most intriguing. Reed. Mr. Holmes. Reed. My colleague. This will certainly a better one comes. Why, you're a common burglar. Now, my friend is a dangerous ruffian. Together we need to go through your house. You have a case, Holmes. Ha! Ah, the faculty of observation is certainly contagious. It has enabled you at once to probe my secret. Yes, I have a case. It is a thankless business, Watson. I'm falling into your involved habit of telling a story back. I don't believe this. You must read this first. <laughs> I do not think I'm in need of booming, Mr. Gibson. Well, we have the means to apply. Of course, it may not be quite ethical. Practical, I congratulate you. You must put your faith in Sherlock Holmes. Was that ever a more exact demonstration? My revolver, Holmes. He's gone mad. Bobst, please. This is Baker Street, not Harley Street. Why do you say so? Shoskin Prince. Watson, you're invaluable. A horse. Hello, old fellow. Thank you. We've got a moment to lose. Come, Jasper. Come, Watson. You still haven't explained why I risked my life this afternoon. It's just a theory. You must be very disappointed. I was almost killed instead. Best I've seen in a long time. <sighs> These are deep waters, Watson. Yes, he's a very fine creature, but you're the expert, Watson. Oh, hardly an expert, Holmes. Huh? Uh, and my feet? Uh, did I tell you about my feet? No. Oh, I'll tell you about my feet. Hence, the note case. Watson, that my patience! Such bare-faced hypocrisy. So how much did you win on Shotskin Prince? Twenty guineas. It's disgraceful. Champagne, Mrs. Hudson. Of course, in the circumstances. Well, it's very good of you, but I've only won 20 guineas. Plus my 10. You're not the only one that likes a plunge on the horses from time to time, Doctor. Morning. Morning. Caught anything? <laughs> not yet. Holmes! What on earth are you doing here? Looking for you. Of course, I shall take nothing for granted until I've had a chance to look into it personally. Naturally. I don't wish to spoil your holiday, but I was wondering if I could persuade you to join me for a couple of days. Well, of course. Are you sure? I should be delighted. Then we must move quickly. Our local train leaves in 35 minutes. Watson, all this fresh air will kill me. Mm. Oh, yes, the case of the counterfeit Spanish dollars. Mexican. Us! You presume that I would come? No, not presume, Watson. Hoped. Very much hoped. And many men have been hanged wrongfully. Oh, look! A pheasant. We're quarrelling face to face. That's a very nice piece of deduction, Watson. Thank you. But hardly a valid one. But I'm so glad that you're coming round to my way of thinking. And Miss Turner's, the boy's innocent. Now, Holmes, you're putting words in my mouth. I didn't say that. But you're thinking it just a little. <laughs> Miss Pocket. <laughs> <laughs> you will remember my little monograph on the subject of ashes from pipe Cigar and cigarette tobacco. One hundred different varieties, if I remember. 
hundred and forty, thank you, Watson. Amazing. Real need of our assistance. Our? If you will be so good, Watson. I should be honored. Mrs. Hudson! You rang, sir? Will you deliver this to the butcher's boy round the corner? That young rascal with the funny eye? The other is invaluable, so is his bicycle. But did you not hear Sir James? His request was to you, Holmes. Oh, that is shameful, Watson. Shameful! Anything more? Yes. Put my pipe on the table from the tobacco slipper. You must rest, not smoke. Oh, very well. Doctor. I could say that it, it should be valued by an expert. Oh, Watson, you scintillate today. Thank you, Sir James, but to tell the truth, I rarely have ever found myself inconvenienced by Scotland Yard. Holmes! Holmes! I've discovered the identity of our client. Watson. Come at once, if convenient. If inconvenient, come all the same. Holmes, I got your note. And it is inconvenient. Damned inconvenient. Wake or dream. I'm summoned here for no more than this. There's more to this than meets the eye. I do not agree. This case is unworthy of you. I must return to my surgery. Maybe I'll see you tomorrow. Now, oh, here's Bennett, precipitate as ever. Come in! Of course. Watson! Watson! Manifestly, a gang is at work. When he leaves the straight road of destiny. Yes, well, I'll leave the philosophy to you, Mr. Holmes. Quite the best, Lestrade. I always do. 